Welcome, I'm Hawaiian Shirt Papa. Sometimes with others, I visit a variety of antique, vintage, and thrift shops within Southern Ontario. Sometimes we don't get anything. Come tour with me vicariously. Hi, and welcome to another tour by Hawaiian Shirt Papa. This time it's the Stretch Thrift Store, located in Toronto. They're uh, the East York General Hospital support. These are views of the uh, showcase windows from the outside. So you can see they have a bit of variety of items that they have on offer. From toys to shoes, clothing, and all sorts of other items. It's just as we're about to go into the door. And here we are inside. As you can see, there's clothing. I did take a look at Bullwinkle here in his canoe. Considered him, but um, don't really have a place for Bullwinkle. I always check to see what these, uh, well, maybe not all of them, but I look at a lot of them in case Westwood Avenue would like it. So this was the only Hawaiian shirt material found in this store at this time. There was a pair of swim trunks. As we continue through, there's, there's, this floor has got all the clothing, the bags, the shoes, some things that are smaller and a higher value as deemed by them. This it appears to be a fake Burberry bag or in the Burberry style. Let's leave it that way. Um, there's a few hard goods up here as well, as well yes. And as we head down, down the aisle, I think there were change rooms right there. If not, that it was uh, something else. And here we are, we're gonna check for the shirts. Going down the aisle. Sorry to disappoint you, but I already kind of gave away the the prize, which was nothing other than the Chanel shirt. I don't count it as being Hawaiian shirts, truly. Yeah, quick look at the uh, pants. Some of the other clothing items and then I find this set of stairs that goes down down and here we find the electronics the LPs the more hired goods um, as we go around looking around here there's the electrical testing stand and they had a portable turntable but it's only looking like it's vintage. It's not vintage. The um, Someone didn't know what to do with a 45 either. So it's got the more common new ones. Friends are like rainbows, always there to cheer you up after a storm, as you saw in this opening splash. There's one that could be used as an irritant by one or the other. Anyway, off with, onto the discs and books and children's wear and toys and other hardware. This is where we actually saw the two plaques. And CDs and so on are laid out in boxes. And then we get some more glassware and ceramics. Downstairs, uh, so you're not only in uh, 
the small amount that you saw upstairs is a, a bit more downstairs. You see some classic toys in here. And uh, we just continue circulating. We'll be going up shortly. These are the little bit of furniture they have. They're all downstairs as well. These actually are in the showcase right at the cache. And this is right beside that area. <clears throat> so here you have uh, some of the more precious items that they've laid out. Some, some of the costume jewelry or jewelry. You can become bejeweled by visiting here. Uh, actually, uh, a T60 Nikon digital camera, and there's the um, memory card that it uses. Anyway, thanks a lot, folks. Hope you enjoyed this. Hope, we hope you uh, also give us a subscription and a like, and maybe even a tinkle on the bell, so you get notified of the next one. Thanks a lot, folks. Bye-bye.